All right, we've got the Tiersen CX-OF and the Veerhook V3, both with optical flow. Optical flow keeps it very stable. So it has altitude hold and a little camera on the bottom that keeps it stable. Um, but it is also pretty nimble. Those little motors are actually pretty powerful. As you can see, we can maneuver this thing pretty well. It spins, it jumps, it even has this programmable dance mode that we'll show you. But look at it go. So here's the programmable dance mode. You can either select a pre-selected um, routine, and here's ours. It'll start dancing here in a second, do some flips and rolls and spins and jiggles. Um, you're going to have to make sure you have plenty of space, which, of course, I did not. You can also, of course, fly it normally. It does have FPV. You see that on the camera coming right through the smartphone. So it'll fly manually as well. You can still do flips and things manually if you like. But the thing that makes this drone so nice is how stable it is. Look at how it's not moving. It just hovers in place. It does a nice job of that, making it an ideal drone for a beginner. Now it is small, um, which is kind of nice, uh, but it also doesn't have a battery that you can change. So the flight time is about three, four minutes if you're really lucky. Uh, so it's not a super long flight time, but while you are flying, it is a lot of fun. So yeah, a good drone for a beginner. It's got FPV. You can take pictures, take video. It's a lot of fun. It's got that fun little uh, dance routine that you can program it and have it go through flips and spins and twists if you want. Let's learn a little bit more about it and then we'll take it outside and get some FPV video from that camera. Now this little quad was originally built by Cheerson and sold as Cheerson CXOF, OF for optical flow, later picked up by Veerhook and probably a handful of others, but it's the same drone, slightly different design for the propellers, but otherwise these two drones are identical in terms of performance and how they fly, so if I'm talking about one or the other, know that it, it pretty much applies to both. Uh, it's a little bit bigger than some of the other micro drones uh, in terms of just sheer kind of bulk uh, but it's interesting it's got a, a camera here for FPV and it's got a camera here for optical flow that's going to help with stability it also has built-in altitude hold uh, which makes it kind of interesting the remote here is different uh, it's nice and compact it's got a place to put your phone now you may have seen this drone also sold as the Cheerson CXOF Cheerson kind of started this whole mini drone thing uh, with the CX-10, that's this guy here, um, and then a lot of other people copied. As far as I know, maybe Cheerson still makes all of these things. Um, this is another uh, interesting one from Veerhook that you may have seen in our Oktoberfest video. You can see it's quite a bit smaller than the V3. Uh, this is the Veerhook Volar 360. Lots of fun with this drone. Uh, definitely check out that video. So we're going to show you this thing in action. Starting with some FPV video from the drone itself. So this video was recorded directly to my smartphone. Uh, I could see it live as the little quad was flying. You can see there's no stabilization. Little drones like these aren't ideal for uh, aerial photography. If you're looking for something uh, to do that, you want something bigger with uh, an HD camera. This is a 0 0.3 megapixel camera. Now we're going to get these both up in the air and fly them around a little, do a little quick uh, maneuvering, some battling, if you will. Uh, they're a lot of fun to fly. Uh, this is me and my eight-year-old flying these two things. I'm not going to tell you who's who because uh, it kind of looks the same. But uh, either way, a lot of fun. Check these out, whether you go with the Veerhook V3 or the Cheerson CXOF. Pretty stable, fun little flyers to have around the house. Thanks for watching. Check out halfchrome.com for more and subscribe to our channel.